welcome parents to module one of grade two. The coverage of this module would be chapters one, two, and three. These are very important chapters for the foundation of your kids' mathematical future. We will be going over pages three to 56 of the pupil book of the Singapore math book, My Pals Are Here. I hope you can follow, and so let's begin. Chapter 1, Lesson 1, Counting to a Thousand. The kids are expected to be able to count and write words up to a thousand. So our lesson begins with blocks of one hundreds. These are rectangles that are tens and smaller boxes that's counted as once. So on page six of PB2A, we will start with problem number one. There are seven of these blocks, and then there's two of these, and there's five of the smaller ones. Okay, so it begins with 100, 200. Okay, so we have seven 100, 100s, which means 100, 200, 300, 400. Skip count, meaning 500, 600, 700. Okay, then we have two of these, which means if this is 710, the next will be 720. Then we have five of these, which means from 721, we skip to 722, 723, 724, and 725. So again, the kids need to be able to skip count in hundreds, in tens, and in ones. Okay, the kids are also expected to be able to write in words. So this in words is 200 and 56. Okay, so we as adults may not be used to using the word and in between these, but in the book, they're expected to write the end. Therefore, we need to teach them to write the end as well. We need to have the dash as well in between 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, and 90. Okay, so which means for this one, this is 400 and 70. One. So there's the dash which is required of them. Okay, so as you can see in number three, they are asked to convert the words to numbers. And if you'll notice, there's an end. Therefore, 809 is 809. Similarly, 900 and, and then there's a dash after 40. So this is 940, 948. As a reminder, we need to teach our kids to skip count. We need to teach our kids to be able to write end when they write the words, as well as be able to put dashes in between the 20, the 30, and the other words. That concludes our lesson for chapter one, lesson one. I'll see you in our next lesson.